So uh, today I want to teach you how to navigate through Trading Leak, how I play and win on Trading Leak, how to deposit on Trading Leak, and how to uh, how to withdraw on Trading Leak. So now, Trading Leak, when we say Trading Leak, is the first like crypto uh, platform, like gaming platform, where you can just uh, play games in form of like trading and make money. And this particular update, people have been making a lot of money there. When you also crack the code and you see how it is being played, you are going to know that, okay, this thing is very, very simple and very, very easy to, to, to actually play. All what you just need is, is a logic. And you apply this, the method I'm applying, the, the orientation that I'm, I'm using, that's just what you need and you, 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 you'll be profitable. You don't necessarily need to be chasing to in a particular game you must win ten dollar fifteen dollar twenty dollar yes people do that people win that you understand but those kind of people if you check them very well maybe after like playing seven games and losing before they now win the twelve dollar or before they win the fifteen dollars like that you understand every time i play all what i'm, I'm targeting in any game is to target ten dollar is to target uh sorry one dollar just one dollar profit, one dollar profit. So I, I I scale up like that. By the time I play like fifty or sixty games, I'm already in sixty dollar in 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 one hour or at at most in one hour thirty uh, thirty minutes. Please, can you still see my screen? No, sir. You suppose you should have told me now. You should have told me you cannot see my screen again. No, I will know. I will quickly come to come and address. You know, I'm not on train on Telegram again. Can you see my screen now? Yes, so now this is the this is the app. The, this is the trading league, and but you know, it's two apps you need to actually participate in this update or to be playing this particular game. Two apps: trading leagues and what and trading view. Trading leagues and what and trading view. This trading view is just like a a store where you package your what you want to sell in the market. Do you understand? So it's where you do your analysis and the likes. So this trading view. Let me firstly show you trading view before we now move to trading league. So this trading view is to show you charts. It's to show you charts. You understand? So any so in in trading league, you, you can play three cryptos: either BTC, ETH, or SOL. Do you understand? But once I play very well, when I play very well, it's BTC because like I understand it is very well. So you add your BTC to it, then you come to this time frame, you change it to what? You change it to one minute time frame. You change it to one minute time frame. So that's that about that. So let's now go to the trading league. So this trading league, there is no app for trading league. There is no app. So you, once you go to your Chrome, you search for trade, you do tradingleague.com, then you sign up using my link. Because if you sign up using my link, you get to enjoy 40% deposit bonus. Like from for all your deposits, up to two hundred dollar, you get to enjoy forty percent bonus. You understand? So after you sign up and everything, you now add you now add to home screen. You understand? So there is there is a drop down menu on Chrome where you can look for okay, add to home screen. So you add to home screen. Once you add to home screen, so you see it like this. Do you understand? So let me now go and navigate the trading link for you. So I've clicked on it. So once you click on it. It's going to bring you here. So game on trade on your total balance. Your own total balance will be zero dollar because you've not deposited. So it will be zero dollar. So let me click on this arrow, this one here. So if I click on it, let me click on this one too. So your gaming balance will be showing zero. Your winning balance will be showing zero. Your athlete earning will be showing what is zero. Do you understand? So it means that you have to deposit. And once you deposit and use my link to sign up, once you deposit, you are going to be entitled to what 40% deposit bonus. Let's say you deposit ten dollar, you are going to get four dollar extra bonus. If you deposit two hundred dollar, you are going to get eighty dollar extra bonus. If you deposit hundred dollar, you are going to get forty dollar extra bonus. Like that, like that. Do you understand? Now let's once let's say you now deposit hundred dollar now. Daily you deposit hundred dollar, your game balance will be showing hundred dollar, but your winning balance will be showing zero dollar. But you can only withdraw. Let's go to this withdraw now. You can only withdraw 
your winning balance. Do you understand? Huh? Or your athlete, and you can only withdraw your, your winning balance. And your minimum withdrawal is your $25. Do you understand? So your minimum deposit is what is ten dollar. So if you are the type that you don't have any money at all at all, you can deposit ten dollar. Do you understand? Minimum deposit is ten dollar. So if you deposit ten dollar, they are going to give you four dollar, making fourteen dollar. Now. I'm going back to the uh, um, example I made. Okay, you deposit hundred dollar. So as you deposit hundred dollar, they are going to give you forty dollar bonus. So your gaming balance will be showing what one forty dollar. But your winning balance will be showing zero. Meaning that you have to trade or play the games. So as you are winning, they will be adding it to your what to your winning balance. Do you understand? As you are winning, you'll be adding to your winning balance. So once your money reach uh, 25, you can withdraw or you can wait till you reach 50, 60, 70, like that, like that. So any question? Can I continue? Can I continue? Hello? Hello? Yes, yes sir. Hello? Yes, sir. Please, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Can you hear me? Hello, please, can you hear me? Sorry. Okay. Yeah, you can hear you, you can continue. Can you see my screen? Yes, I can see your screen, sir. Can you see my screen? Yeah. That's fine. Okay. So now, as I've explained that one, now, how do you now deposit? How do you deposit? So click on this, see the, this deposit. So you can only deposit USDT. So which so you can choose any network, BSC network, Ethereum network, Polygon network, TRC network. But please and please don't choose Ethereum network. Because once you choose Ethereum network, the gas fee for Ethereum is like $25. How much do you want to deposit that? The gas fee will now take $25. Do you understand? So just leave it at this BSC that it was left like this. So leave it at this BSC dollar like this. BSC uh, network. So the next thing is what? How much do you want to deposit? Let's say I want to deposit $20 now. Or let's say the $100 that I was using as an example. So you click on $100, then you click on deposit. I'll click on deposit. So as I click on deposit, so they show me this one. So you can actually, you can either copy the address, eh? copy the address, or at times, at times, okay, this is what it will bring for you. The old might bring this one this site it might bring you to this site you get so this is the site okay i want to deposit hundred dollar with a uh, guest network so i will now click on what this copy can you see recipient wallet address so i'll copy this thing can you see address was copied then i will now go to where do i want to deposit from is it from binance is it from bybit anywhere that you want to deposit from so me i want to deposit from my binance I want to deposit from my Binance. So I will click on USDT. Sorry. Network. Ah, oh my God. Sorry, guys. Maybe I will have to use my bike because I cannot share my existing. So, okay. So I want to deposit. So I want to deposit USDT. So the amount you want to deposit, you click on it. 
So the, uh, now I click on deposit in trading trading dig. So I will click on withdraw here. That is, I want to withdraw from this place to the what to go and deposit it in what in trading dig. Do you understand? So click on USDT, then paste the address that was given to me here. I will paste the address. The address that I copy here, I'm going to paste this here. So paste it. Paste the address. So I've pasted the address. Then I will now choose how much do I want to deposit. So which cha which chain? BEP20. It was BSC Network I choose. Then how much do I want to deposit? $100, right? So I'll click on $100. Then I'll click on what? On withdraw. But if you are using Binance, you have to add the charges. I think Binance charges uh, 0.12. You understand? Like, like, look at see this one now. For Bybit, Bybit charges is 0 0.3 dollar. Do you understand? So you click on it. So that's it. So just make sure that the amount that will be received, that is the amount that is going to your to your Bybit, uh, to your trading link, is the exact amount. Let's say I want to deposit uh, 40 dollar now. If you, if it is Binance, if you want to deposit 40 dollar. If you click on forty dollar in the amount, it will be showing forty three point nine seven. Do you understand? So it means you have to add point three or point one nine. I've actually forgotten. So once you click on, on you put that one, it will show the once the amount received on shall be showing forty dollar or hundred dollar or any amount you want to deposit. Then you click on withdraw. Once you click on the withdraw, then you put your password and everything, everything. So after you don't do that. This one will, you will wait for it once payment payment has been made. So it's saying checking blockchain transaction. Later you see that okay payment has been made. It will mark it. So once it's marked it like that, it's going to show this one to that payment completed. It will not be showing payment initiated again, and your account will be what will be credited. Your account will be credited. Do you understand? So that's how it is. So that's how to deposit. If you want to withdraw, same thing. Click on withdraw. Click on withdraw. Where do you want to withdraw to? BSC network. Then you go and copy your BSC network in your Binance or your Bybit, USDT, BEP20 or BEP20 network. So you paste it here. Withdraw from what? From your winning balance. How much do you want to withdraw? You click on any amount you want to withdraw. Then you click on what? Withdraw amount. Do you understand? So that's that about withdrawal too. Now, how do you play the games? How do you play the games? Can you still see my screen? Can you still see my screen? So how do you play the games? To play yes, the games, yes, there are four ways. You can, there are four things you can play. You can play target leagues. You can play selection leagues. You can play classic leagues, and you can play um, battle leagues. So you can play any of these four. Do you understand? So, but the ones that I play very well is the target leagues. Is target leagues that I play. Not to concern me with selection league, battle leagues, and classic leagues. So I play only target leagues. Now these target leagues are divided into two. We have long hour game and short hour game. It's the short games. The short games are every two to two minutes, while the long hour games are 24 hour game and one hour game. Do you understand? But nothing concerned with 24 hour game and one hour game. What I play is every two to two minutes. I enter games every two to two minutes. Now you have option to play either Bitcoin or Ethereum or Solana. Then if you are a Forex person, you can click on the others. You can play Euro USD. Or stocks, stock 100. Do you understand? So that's that. So a recap of what I said. I said I play only target leagues. Click on target leagues. Then it will bring you which one do you want to? Is it Bitcoin? Is it Ethereum? Is it Solana? So I like playing Bitcoin very well. So I click on Bitcoin. So once I click on Bitcoin, can you see these are the short hour games? So short games, just two minutes duration. These are the one hour duration. Do you understand? Then this is the daily long games for 24 four hours, which is one day. Do you understand? But nothing concerned me with what hour long games and daily long games. I'm only concerned with what intraday day games every two two minutes. They will give me two minutes to decide my option. Then the game will last for what for two minutes. Now let me click on this one to show you as an example. Now, now look at it. One thing I want you to know is that. Uh, Look at this. It's only two players that are here. It's supposed to, you can only, with all these intraday games, you can only use one dollar to enter. Even if you are Elon Musk, the amount you can only use to enter is what? Is one dollar. It's only one dollar everybody is allowed to use to enter the market. Do you want to enter? So now, if you en enter, so entry fee is one dollar. Your duration is in two minutes. Then, how many players are playing? 
will be showing here. You don't understand. So let's say, look at like this now. So then, you know, it's four dollar because everybody is going to give one one dollar. So I'm five players now. So this one is supposed to be showing five dollar. Yes, you are right. But the, the reason why it's showing three point five dollar is because for every game that you are playing, the company the trading they, they take thirty percent from the price pool. They take thirty percent. Why the remaining seventy percent will be for the winners? So if not one person win, the only the one person will take all this money in the price pool. If not two people win, so they are going to divide the money into two and they will credit those two people. If not three people win, same thing. If not ten people win, they will divide the team by ten. Then credit everybody. Do you understand? Now, what are the options you play? You can pick. You can see this one remain. This is where you'll be using to check how many minutes remain for you to pick your options. Do you understand? How many minutes remain for you to pick your options? So it remain 14 seconds now. Now, the ones I only pick, I only pick either greater than or less than. Not to concern me with range. What I pick is either greater than or less than. So I will tell you the reason why I pick either less than or greater than this one particular game has started. Let me go and look for another one. So why do I pick either greater than or less than? The reason why I pick either greater than or less than is that I cannot, I'm not actually like gambling or I'm not gambling that the market will be within this range. Like I'm not predicting correct exact price. I'm just like, okay, the market should just go above this thing or go below or beyond this particular uh, uh, price. Do you understand? This is the current market price now, 57,215. So this one is saying that it should be 57,000, greater than 57,183 or less than 57,160. These are ranges, not to concern me with range. Now, now look at it. Which one should I pick? This one or this one? Look at now, greater than 57,183, but Bitcoin is already at 57,215. So you can see that this one has even already played out even before the game starts. Because the game will start in 58 seconds now. Do you understand? So me, I might be actually be deciding to, work, to to pick this one. Even before the game starts, the market is already like uh, showing that. Do you see? It's at 239 and it's at less than 153. I can now still go and check chart too. I did check chart too at times. So I check charts. Can you see on the chart? Market is going up, 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 up. Do you understand? It's going up. So me, I will go and pick this one. I will go and pick this one. So I will enter, click on proceed, then click on join contest. Click on join contest. So can you see, link joined successfully. I've actually entered this one and I picked this one. So it's five players that are in the game currently. So, and if now two of us pick this one, if we win, we are going to win $2 each. But if the game comes to this place, now this particular person will win all the $4. If the game, one person, this person will win four dollars. This one, nobody picked it. Do you understand? So that's how it is. But later, can you see people later joined? People later joined. Can you see? So 10 people joined. So all of us are going to gain what one one dollar each. Look at the reason why people joined is because look at 57,300. And the game is what you say it should be greater than what 57,183. You can see that the game the game has even already played out before market starts. Do you understand? So this one, I'm very sure that I'm going to win this one like this. So let me go and look for another one and use it as example. Do you, do you guys understand what I was teaching? Do you get what I was saying? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. So now look at it now. This is the chart. This is the chart now. Look at it. So Bitcoin has, is at 57,004. 57,004. So... What what is the, what are the options? The option is what fifty seven thousand three fourteen or less than fifty seven thousand two ninety two. Do you understand? So the current market is at what fifty seven thousand two eighty five. You can see that. Okay, it's still within range. I still have fifty seconds more to pick. So which one do you think? Do you advise me to pick? So can you see? We are at three sixty four. 57,364. My network self is fluctuating like this thing is supposed to have gone up. So to me, I'm going to pick, okay, 57,311, 305, 292, 280, 215. 
can you see the market has actually dropped very well so i will pick this one 57,292. why do i pick that one why do i pick less than 292 can you see the market has 235 so can you see the market was dropping that's why i picked that one do you understand do you understand so 11 of us picked this one so if we win, we are going to win one, one dollar each. Is there, are you getting how I'm picking the, the options? Are you getting how I'm picking it? So it's actually that is, is, is that simple. So when people are saying they are not getting it on the group, that's what I just don't know how they are not getting it. It's very simple, very simple. And I'm very sure the reason why some of them are burning their accounts is because they want to make like, if to say the market come to this place now, these two people are going to win seven seven dollars. That's how. So if you want, if you cannot pick this thing, so just come to this place, then click on what open. So I will open this thing. So if the market come to this place, the, these two people are going to win seven seven dollars. Yes, that's how lucrative it is. So if three people, they are going to win five dollars. So all these ranges, if you pick and you win, the, the winnings are always like very very high. They are always very, very high. So that's why some people are so, so greedy that what they will be looking for is all this $7, $10. No, no. It's this small, small. Do you understand? If I win $1 in this game, I win $1 in another game. I win $1. If I play, by the time I play 10 games, I've already won $10. Do you understand? So that's how I, I, I play my own games. Do you get? So you, you look at the chart. What is the chart saying? That's how you pick. Do you understand? So like this one now, I think I will lose this one. So those who are the people that win, these five people, they are going to win $33 each. Okay, the, the, the market is dropping, dropping again. Can you see the market has dropped back to this place? So what is it going to do? The market is fluctuating very well, very well. So I want that one too. I want it. I want that one too. Can you see the markets come down? I want that one too. So let me go and pick another one too and still show you. So I still have two minutes. I have one hour, 15 minutes to pick. Which one am I going for? I have told you I'm always going for either greater than or less than. Nothing concerned me with range. I'm not greedy. I'm not looking for quick money, like to make $10, $15 in a particular game. No. So now look at it. The market is at 57258 currently. So they say it should be greater than 57,297 or less than what? 274. So can you see less than 274? But the market is at 270 already. You can see that this thing is actually looking as if it's coming down. Do you understand? Because it has already played out even before the market starts. The market has not started. So I will go and check my trading view and look. Okay, what is the market saying? You can see we are still going down more. We are still going down more. So I, will, I will still wait. I wait for like 11 seconds before I enter. I will always wait for like 11 seconds before my, before I enter because markets can fluctuate and do anything. But it's very, very simple. If you don't know how to analyze at all, at all, you can be waiting for all these games that have already played out even before the market starts. So that like, like that will be scaling up your winning balance, small, small. You win $1 now, you win $1 in the next game, you win $1. Before, by the time you play 10 games, you've already, your winning balance is already ten dollars than to be to lose seven times and now win one that will give you ten dollars do you understand what's the probability that you will not bond the account before you later win the one that you want to win do you understand so that's how it is now look at it the market is at 15 000, 57 to 17 and this one this option is saying that it should be less than what 57,274. do you understand so you see that it has already played out so i will join Okay, I was unable to join this one, but let's look at it. Let's see if it's played out. I'm already able to, to join this one, but it's at 7,218. Because as I was explaining, I actually totally forget that I was teaching you guys something. So, can okay, it's 241, now 274, it's still playing out. So, that's how to play this game. Do you understand now? Do you understand now? Hello? Hello. So, so that's how to play the games. It's that simple. It's that simple. That's how to play the games. What I target is either greater than or less than. 
I target either greater than or less than. So what is the market? What does the market want to do? So I would I will now know. So can you see it will have some will have played out even before the market will start. Then you just pick that one. Your your main target is what is to make sure that your winning balance is increasing. Is to make sure that your winning balance is increasing. So can you see? You know, I started with with uh, twenty six dollar, and I win two games. Can you see? My my money has increased. So that's how I played. I played fifty times. Like I can even in that fifty times, maybe like five times, I will lose. Or let's say max seven times, because I I already know what I'm doing. Do you get? It's either I'm not greedy. I'm just looking to scale up by one one dollar in every game that I play. It's either I play greater than or less than. Now I will now look at it. What's the current market price? What is the, uh, how is the chart looking at? Then, uh, which one will I pick? Do you get? Do you get me now? Do you get me now? Hello. Yes, so, are you? Yes, do you understand how to play the game now? Yes, sir. So that's how it is. So thank you very much, everyone. I really, really appreciate. It. So later. Okay.